Bollinger, a.k.a. Number One Rock Star, a.k.a. Electrical Doctor. Um, I have been doing some electrical doctoring today. Uh, see, uh, what happened was, uh, I'll just give you the lowdown. Uh, earlier I looked, I was going to, um, call... something, you know, to check on something, and, um, I noticed that the lights on my phone weren't on, and it wasn't working, it wasn't charging, because the cord was damaged, uh, so I'm like, ah, oh, great, well, my rabbit had chewed the cord before, so I had to do electrical doctoring to get it wired back together, <coughs> and I did. That surgery went well. Uh, it was touch and go for a minute, but I got him all put back together, and he was running fine. Well, then today I noticed it, it was not working. It shut down. His lights, his, you know, his lights line was shut down. So, uh, got the cord kind of messing with a little, a little, and it wouldn't work, so I'm like, oh man, and like when stuff like this happens, I tend to overreact sometimes, I just hate, okay, I know it's a, I know it's a part of life, and this and that, you know, and there's a diff different things in life that you deal with, right, but like I, now, like I started calling it nuisance nonsense, you know, just because it's like, just stuff you don't want to hassle with, you know? And I'm like, like, you know, just like saying the F word and stuff, you know? And, um, like, oh, Lord, why me? You know, oh, Jesus, why me? You know, what? Come on, please, God, help me. I just don't want to deal with this right now. You know, I got enough stuff going on in my head and everything. I don't need this. You know? another patient who needs to get the surgery, or the patient needs a surgery again, or whatever, you know, well, I, uh, I got the scissors, and I just, you know, started doing the surgery, and, um, put them together, and plugged them in, and didn't work, you know, I'm like, oh, great, so now what, must be shorted out, or something, you know, must have fizzled out, I don't know, so I go in the bedroom, and in my closet, um, and I, I just use that as to store some stuff now, in case I have some time to do stuff, so, um, yeah, I went in there, and in my closet, I have this big wad of tangled up wires, so let me go get it and show you. always been a staple in my life. I wonder if any of you out there have stuff going on like this in your house. Do you have stuff like that going on? This has always been something that's been going on. This actually, this piece, um, I got from somebody else. I inherited this. Okay? Uh, but in my life, I've always had stuff like this going on. You know? And in my bedroom, oh wow, look. My star, my number one rock star star, uh, my birthday thing that, you know, that I got going on. Um, well, I've always had this kind of stuff going on. Uh, in my room when I was younger, I actually would hang these on my wall. Like with a nail, you know, like just like hang it on the wall as a display. And, uh, you know, it comes in handy. It comes in handy sometimes if one of your cords fizzles out or you lose a cord to something or a wire, then, you know, well, I might have that, you know, up in my piece of mess. But that's the issue is trying to get it untangled and figuring out what you got there, right? It's like in that mixed bag, that tangled up mess. Well, it's the same kind of thing if you have Christmas lights and then you just, like, 
When you put them away, you don't throw them away in an organized fashion so they don't get all tangled up and you have to get like extra unravel them. It's always a fun way. For people who've dealt with that, and I've dealt with that a lot. Can I help me unravel this? You know, and stuff. Uh, so yeah, I was doing that and I'm like, it was the same thing. I'm like, oh, I should do this. Please help me. I do not feel like going through with it. I'm, I don't feel like doing this. And he's like, you know, just quick and knot it up now. So I'm starting to try and knot it down here so I can get further along and stuff. And I'm like, sick. I can't even think it's sick. You know, and it's like, the, the texture has been in there and it's like dusty and like moldy kind of, you know, and like the texture of the wires is like yucky and grimy. And I'm like, oh, this is sick, you know. And my hands come all funny afterwards. I'm like, I don't feel like having a knot. Or, well, I was digging through that, and this happened. This all happened for a reason, okay? You know, it turns out all the time this stuff all happens for a reason. I found one of my favorite things. Okay, just a second as I'm talking about it, because I was just trying to kind of pop things in here. Um, I found one of my favorite things. This is a clicker ball. Clicker and ball. You know, it's suddenly not working. Like we did earlier and it was working. Okay, do you see this though? Plug it in and there's the clicker. There's the clicker, just a second, okay? Is the, it was just working. Yep, well, I guess I see it's not working at all. Oh, now it is, great, great. Now, look at that. Does that not look like a real thing? And this is just, I just love this. Ever since I discovered this. I used to go make special trips to the store just to get these because I really like them. Well, I have to find something to put this on. This is a, this was in a lamp that I had, but the lamp broke or something, and I got rid of it. So it's just this little stand that I just have right now that it's. But I can just stand here holding this and think, wow, isn't that cool? I think the best. Oh, I sure hope it doesn't fall out. I sure hope it works. Now I can't. I don't want to unplug it because I don't want it to, like, you know, not work. So I'm just going to leave it plugged in for a minute and put it in there. So I can enjoy this. But then I don't want to leave it plugged in because I don't want to wear it out, you know. Touch and go. Because, uh, <laughs> because can you find these anymore? Do they still sell these? Or, you know, or, I mean, are they... I always think stuff like this, I always think this is going to, like, disappear, you know? So I have to keep this, just, just keep things, you know? Maybe you don't know. I'll try to quit saying you don't know so much. I was going to say, if I want to try to quit saying that too much. Um, yeah, no, I'm serious. Yeah, i got to try to quit saying that so much too. That's what I think. Well, make it kind of just something like that. Well, okay, here's the story again. Back to the phone. Okay, that I found in the store. Now, back to the phone. I still needed to try to find a cord to hook the phone, okay? I'm looking at the store, seeing if they have the same adapter and the same uh, wattage and output and stuff. second cord and I did a second screw through because I thought well okay you know that adapter is not working you know if I get another adapter and then uh, switch it on to the, the thing clicker <laughs> um, then maybe it will it will start working right because maybe this one part shorted out tried that that was a no-go. 
that didn't work either. So that was a no go. <laughs> you know, people who say stuff like that. No, that was a no go. Well, then I was like, oh man, this is crap. And I was typing on it because it says like transgenders and well, what I'm getting ready about my struggles at that point. What I was getting ready, I was struggling, you know, at that point. Just, you know, just trying to let every, everybody know uh, what I was going through with this pillow thing. So, um, I was going, this is a real crisis, folks, a real crisis. So, then I was like, oh man, and I was like kind of stalking it for a minute. And then I put that wad of cords back in the bedroom and I just squished the sheets back, you know. And I was like thinking about where I could get another phone and all these bad thoughts were in my head like that, you know, like that all phones and stuff, like stuff I don't want to deal with, like, you know, like stolen phones. I got two phones here, but I just can't get them for work, like because of the power cord stuff. Like, I don't want to deal with this whole how am I going to call somebody on the phone on a pay phone and call somebody and ask if I can borrow a phone or get a ride to the store and get a phone and take them to get a phone, you know? All this stuff going through my head like this is, like I don't want this in my life, right? Already kind of like, just okay, so uh, I already got enough stress with stuff going on. Just crazy stuff. Well, mostly it's like other people, the way they take things, you know, and then like, it's like, it's always like, is this person trying to screw with me with something, you know, or like, what's really going on and stuff, are they like trying to set me up or something, for, you know what I'm saying, like, or like, somebody's gonna take this the wrong way, like, I'll, like I do a song or something, and I think, oh, somebody's gonna like, think that it's, somebody's gonna take this the wrong way, start crazy or something, and it's just stuff like that, and I try not to worry about stuff like that, but you know, it still it, yeah. well, okay, so the phone, then I go over to the phone stand, there it is, and I see that I got another power cord dangling from it that I didn't know I had, right, that somebody had shielded. I said, you know, put them up uh, to where he hopefully can't reach them, but he may only think he did it, but then nonetheless. Um, and he was looking for you. Where are you, man? Where are you, man? Where did you go? I can't hear you. So he had to grab this to grab the power cord because it's very dangerous. And if one of them happens to get hurt, something bad happening. So, uh, yeah, well, I found that cord dangling there, and it, it wasn't plugged in, it was just dangling there, and he had chewed on it, he chewed it up before. So, and then I got that one, and then I grabbed the piece to the other one that I was uh, trying to doctor, right? And then I hook, I connected that, and I'm like, I just kind of had a feeling that one was going to work, you know, third time's the charm, never is going to work, you know, it doesn't work, so, plugged it in, sure enough, the light, the red lights came on, and, uh, good to go, good to go, and yet, that was touch and go, too, for a minute, that was touch and go, but it worked out. Oh, I was thinking of something too. Do you know that? Remember that song? When I think about you, I touch myself. That that lady did. I gotta give her credit for that, cause like that takes courage, you know, to to release a song like that. Like when I think about you, I touch myself. 
You know, it would have been cooler though if she would have named the guy's name that when she, the guy's name that she that she was talking about when she was saying it's wrong and stuff and everything else. Like, I, she it should have been like. You know, that would have made it, like, if she would have revealed the guy's name. That would have made it, like, that much better, you know? Like, that much tighter. Still, still, you know. Uh, but still. Nonetheless. Oh, yeah. So, yeah, this, this phone thing, I'm really, really, I'm thankful and I'm glad this thing worked out. I'm glad it all worked out for the best with that because the thing I don't like it when things break down who does you know especially somebody who doesn't have very much money it's like and then a lot of times it seems like it all starts happening at once you know my computer charger is screwing up this but I'm trying to keep the stuff like this is still messed up I'm trying to keep it put together though somewhat I got some super glue a while back here's another thing with the three I got some super glue at Walmart a while back, along with, okay, I got some groceries, right? Somehow, I left at the store super glue, package of three t-shirts, and a bottle of wine. Left behind at Walmart. I have a little bit of an overreaction to that, too, but um, I haven't been able to fix my power cord, or my charger to my computer yet, but I have it sitting there, and I have to keep it still. That's why I'm kind of always in the same spot, because I have to keep it still. Uh, I haven't really been doing as many dance videos and stuff lately, pretty much because of my computer charger, and I don't do as many videos, I can say, as many, uh, you know, videos where I have to move stuff around, and I... I have to say I'm a little more nervous during my videos that I'm going to be in the middle of it when the system will like all shut down because it happens, you know, I can't turn it off, so, okay, it's rigged up totally this way, everything in this apartment is currently rigged up, okay, rigged, rigged up, is the word, up, so everything's like, like this, okay, and then, <laughs> you know, so, don't come over and you just like start touching stuff, okay? Because you'll probably get your ass messed up, okay? <laughs> Something will happen and it's going to be something. Uh, just thought. I just uh, put that together. I got to put some tape over the ends of that, though, over the ends that are exposed so I don't end up zapping myself. But that renewed my confidence in electrical doctoring because, so, you know, sometimes when something doesn't work out, I just end up thinking, screw it up, I failed. <laughs> I should know what, I should know how to, how to resolve this. But I feel foolish, you know, I feel like I don't know how. But now I feel pretty, I feel better. I feel better because I got it working. So I feel like that's cool, I got it working. Um, oh, uh, something I was going to talk about was, uh, about how, like, um, yeah, about things breaking down and stuff like that, or, or, I try not to complain too much about stuff that I don't have, because whatever your lot in life is at a certain point, that's just what it is and what it's meant to be. And, um, I'm never, and I've, I'm never jealous of anybody for what they have or anything like that or much of this, because, uh, I'm just not, you know, because uh, I realize that that's just their lot and that's their karma and I got my own karma. And, that can change at any point, you know what I mean? That can change at any point. And being jealous or envious of somebody is not going to speed that along. So, um, yeah, I 
biggest ice dragon is just um, more often now than I used to just be thankful that I have a place to live in a winter time. You know, when it's cold right now and there's no place in the summer, um, you know, like I could name off all these things I don't have that I wish I had and whatnot. But for right now, when you're in a, when you're right now, I'm not saying you don't strive for little things. Yeah, strive for those things. You should strive for those things, but nonetheless, when God wants us to have something or not have something or let something transpire, then that's the, that's, that's what's happening with that. We don't always like it or accept it as something we want, but to remember that there is a reason for everything and, and that things are happening for a reason and just the way it's going, right? It's a process of the way things are going. So that's with it, right? With it at, at any point in your life, there are a lot of ups and downs and obstacles. Sam and Sarah, you know. Uh, but we can we can overcome the challenges. I'm not. I'm a motivational speaker right now. This is more of a motivational speaker. I'm saying I'm motivated every day. It's like you're kind of motivate everybody. <laughs> so everybody out there, you just think about that. Yeah. And you think about it. Well, that's really all I have for today right now. I got this lion's lighter, and I guess the lions are playing, so it's like I'm, I'm kind of acting like I'm like, I'm in this thoughts and that. I'm kind of on here right now, kind of doing this, but really I'm not. I'm just fixing a power switch because I don't have to go that day. I don't have any foot log in. I am, I am bleaching my jet strap in the sink, though. Go for a long one. Go be a spiral. Right? Yeah. All about that. Uh, well... have yourselves a good one. Uh, I'll be back later with another show. I just gotta get some things taken care of around here. I need to get try to get something else to eat. Maybe order a sub or something because all I really have here are eggs and that's been kind of bad. I didn't get much sleep last night and I, I woke up feeling kind of defeated and then I just I saw that all I have to eat are eggs and that kind of made me feel even more upset. But again, I'm thankful I have something to eat at least, you know, some, some food, some eggs, and I have sweet potatoes too, so I have eggs and sweet potatoes. Doesn't that sound delicious to you? Hey, something to eat, right? Not my egg, it's not my egg rolls, I really, I, I don't know. Well, I'll get it figured out. Just I'm pretty egged out right now. I'm pretty egged out right now. <laughs> but I'm not starving, so that's great. Alright, peace. Have yourselves a good one. Later.